Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in front of me, I have the Kerry kit, Greta in the color dark gray. Guys, this is such a cute bag. I love it. Um, definitely going to keep in my perma stash a couple of these um, in different colors because it's just that cute. So we're still in stage four lockdowns at the moment, which means we cannot go anywhere besides um, exercise and some of the essentials. So my husband does all of our grocery shopping and stuff like that. So I'm actually at home a lot with the girls. So I don't really have the opportunity to take these bags out, but today I'm like, you know what? I'm taking the grid out for a walk just because, um, because <laughs> you know, it's just so pretty to just sit at home. So today we're gonna have a look at how I have the Greta packed up as well as doing bag comparisons um, with other brands as well as color comparisons and just see what accessories also fit in this front pocket so if this is something that you're interested in um, stay tuned so let's see how I have the Greta packed up today okay so now you're probably gonna hear me say this a hundred times in this video because I'm so obsessed now I love the quilting on the Greta and this is something about how soft it feels I don't know how it's made but it just feels incredibly soft and it just looks really amazing on the Greta like just have a look at it it's so nice and pretty so in this front pocket when I unzip it you get the Kerry kit uh, champagne lining that's in all of the bags and in just sitting in front here is my poppy wallet this is in the color antique rose it's so beautiful and I just thought it paired really nicely with the gray now inside this pocket there's also one two three four slots for your card and there's a little pen holder here and there's also a slip pocket with a little bit of elastic and this is where I keep my mask because as you know nowadays you just can't go anywhere without a mask so in this front pocket is where I normally like to keep my phone as well but I am filming with my phone so that's why it's not there and it still had a little bit more space for me to pack a few more things if I needed to but that's how I have it packed up I want to mention that I really love this front pocket because I find it quite spacious. I like that from um, the left to the right, it's quite long. And then if you turn the bag to the side, you can see here the way it's designed, it sticks out this pocket. So you can pack it up with whatever you like and you can pack it pretty full and it's not going to really dig into the main compartment, which is really awesome. So the Greta has side pockets, one on each side, and it has a zip top closure with two zipper pulls, which is really nice. And on this side, I decided that I would pack a pocket size tissue packet. So I thought it was pretty cool to keep a packet of tissues here because when I need tissues, all I need to do is grab whatever I need out and the packet just sits really nicely in there and I don't have to fiddle around with it when I need tissues. So this ended up being um, really practical for me. On the other side pocket, today I had Alicia's dummy just sitting on top here. She's using it at the moment, so that's why it's not in there. And then just sitting at the bottom is a little tub of Vaseline. Now, Haley and I get really dry lips when the weather changes from winter to, to spring. I was going to say autumn, to spring. Um, so it's always really handy to have one of these with me. Guys, are you ready for this? <laughs> Now, I have thought about what I would pack in this side pocket. Now, if I don't need the Vaseline and the dummy, and I was to go out and, you know, um, on a date night or visit my friends or whatever, I tend to like to keep lip balm and lipstick just for myself um, in my bag. So I thought, why not try and fit it into the side pocket? Now, obviously, with them loosely, they would fit really nicely in here, and it's not going to go anywhere because it's quite a small pocket, but it would be like a really nice fit. But I do like to put my lip balm and lipstick in one of these accessories. It's called the Oprah from Kerry Kit. Now look how nicely that fit in there. So I've got, I'll show you, I'll pull it out. I've got my lipstick, I've got two sticks, and I could probably fit a lip balm on top, but I just couldn't find mine. And it closes really nicely. It's a, it's a really nice fit. And then it fits into this side pocket. And it's a little snug, but it doesn't get caught in the zips at all. It's actually a really nice um, place to put it. So that's a cool idea. Now, so if you like to use your Oprah for cards or, um, you know, like a little med kit or whatever you, however you like to pack it, just know that it fits in the side pocket of the Greta really nicely. So that's another idea for you. 
So when you turn the bag around, you have this really nice slip pocket that has a magnetic closure. In the back here, I like to keep a pack of wipes because you always need wipes, especially nowadays, you know, you wipe everything down. So I like to keep a pack of wipes at the back because it's just easy access, easy for me to just pull the wipes in and out as I need them. And here's the magnet really strong which is really nice so if you put your phone or whatever in here you know that um, it's going to keep it nice and secure now at the bottom of the bag you have four gold studded feet which is really nice and it just keeps the bottom of the bag nice and protected so let's have a look at how I have the Greta packed up um, in the main compartment so once again you have two zipper pulls when you open it it's quite a nice opening and sitting on top, I have my keys. Now, I have pretty chunky keys. I could fit it in the front pocket, but I just have this thing where I don't like to pack my keys and my phone in the same pocket. I do worry that it would scratch my phone. So I don't mind just having it sitting on top like that. Now, if I was to do a quick trip, like um, to drop off Haley and kinder at Kindy, I would just have my keys hooked onto the D-ring on the side there, and that wouldn't be a problem at all. Um, but because we're just going for a walk, I don't mind just having it sitting on top. As you can see, there's still plenty of room to pack um, a few more things sitting on top there. Um, but this is how I have it packed up. So just sitting um, on the left-hand side in the uh, bottle pocket, I have Alicia's milk bottle. This bottle pocket here is insulated as well, which is really nice because especially at the moment, um, Alicia is being formula fed, so it's really nice to have her milk nice and warm when we go for our walk. Sitting right next to that pocket, I have the um, theme change pack from Carry Kit. I just kind of had it rolled up like that, and I had it just sitting tucked on the side there. This is a really nice change pack because it's so lightweight, really thin, but also at the same time, pretty big for me to change Alicia in if I need to. So that's really cool. Now, just sitting over here, I have a nappy for Haley. She's size five and it's um, one of those pull-ups. I had it folded in half just so it was just a nicer fit. And then in front of that, I had one for Alicia that was folded in half as well. And then I have an outfit for Alicia. So I just wanted to show you guys quickly that if you didn't need that side bottle pocket, the outfit and the nappies and the wipes all fit in the main compartment really nicely. I had to fold um, the nappies in half just so then the bottle would fit on the side. But if you don't need that bottle pocket for anything, everything fits in really nicely there. And then now you've had this um, back slip pocket free for you to put your phone or whatever, whatever else that you need. I just want to show you now that the main compartment is completely empty um, there is no other internal organization besides the back pocket here with the zip top closure and also that bottle pocket that's insulated um, and this pocket at the back here is leather trimmed and it has the carry kit name on it and what I packed in here is a small set piece from Jujubee in this small set piece, it's my med kit. I keep band-aids, uh, Panadol, hair ties, nail clippers, just all the things that I tend to need to carry with me every day, everywhere we go, especially nail clippers because the girls always get a little scratchy. Um, the nails seem to grow so fast. So anyway, that fit really nicely in the back pocket. And I just want to mention as well, if you're new to Carry Kit, their lining is absolutely amazing. It's water resistant as well, which is something that you really need when you have young kids. Um, I guess even as a date night bag, honestly, I tend to get a little clumsy sometimes and I spill things. So it's really nice to know that that is water resistant. And if I get it dirty, I can just spot clean it. Okay, so now it's time to have a look at what fits in the front pocket as well as the main compartment. So we'll start off with wallets. I have the Limea Gabby wallet. I use this wallet from time to time and that fits inside the front pocket very nicely. There's a little bit of room on each side so it doesn't get caught when you want to zip up the pocket. And if it fits in there, it's obviously going to fit into the main compartment as well. And it just looks like that. The other wallet I have is just my coach wallet. Now this is just like a standard size wallet that also fits in there. Almost perfect. Um, it's actually not tight at all. Still room to add a phone in and that will zip up quite easily. So once again, that's going to fit in the main compartment 
just fine. Now the other one I have is the Millie Wallet. Now I don't know when there'll be a situation where you need the Millie Wallet as well as the Greta, but just so you guys, you know, just for reference, um, it's not going to fit in the front pocket. And it looks like it does fit into the main compartment, but it's a little fiddly. Let me have a look. Okay, so it does fit, but it's quite snug. It's actually hitting the side of the bag, but it will close up if you need it to. So there you go. That's the Millie wallet. Next, we have the Kerry Cute George. These two, um, I think this one came out first and then this one came out after. They're about the same size. So I think that um, if one fits, so will the other. So let's see if it fits in the front pocket. The George fits very nicely. And once again, it's probably going to fit in the main compartment as well. So there you go, it fits. Okay, so now let's have a look at how you can accessorize the bag. Now to start off with, the Greta already comes with a strap that is completely adjustable and it has like a leather um, strip on top and just behind it has like this seatbelt material. I actually found this strap really comfortable. I've worn it over the shoulder and crossbody with my Greta packed full just like around the house and I found it really comfortable. Now at its shortest length, it's just maybe about 10 centimeters um, longer than the Gretchen strap like the way it's sitting and I actually preferred it in that way but at the, in saying that I'm not saying that don't get the Gretchen strap because I think that the Gretchen strap is really pretty so if you want to just you know bling up your bag a little bit this is a really nice accessory so all you have to do is attach this clip to the side d-ring on one on each side like that really simple and there you go, you've got a extra strap that you can just carry over the shoulder and it just looks really nice. And if you like to carry it over the shoulder as well as crossbody and you don't really want to adjust the strap, you just want both straps on the bag, that's an option too. So this you can have adjusted to maybe your crossbody length and then this one will just be sitting here for whenever you need to grab it out of the car and just pop it over your shoulder. So that's a good option too. But I did want to make, um, I did want to mention that this strap that comes with the bag is really nice as well. So you don't have to feel like maybe that strap is not enough and you have to buy something else. This is just something extra that you can add on to if you like. And you know, if you just like the look of it. So yeah, both really comfortable. This strap is really wide, cushiony because of the leather and the hardware is absolutely stunning. Now, I'm not a huge tassel girl myself, like if the bag already comes with it, then great, but I don't really um, tend to buy tassels just to, you know, add onto my bag. Kerry Kit is probably the first brand that I have bought like luggage tags and warrior tassels because I think it just looks really cute. Now, the Greta doesn't come with any tassels or anything like that. Kerry Kit doesn't sell like tassels besides the warrior tassel, and that looks like this. Now I didn't buy one to match the grey Greta because for a bag this size I personally don't really want anything dangling because I think the Gretchen strap and the strap itself is enough for me personally but I know a lot of you ladies love your extra you know accessories so I just wanted to show you what it looks like so with the warrior tassel on the side it kind of looks like that so it's quite long and on the other side, I'll attach a luggage tag in the color dove gray. My warrior tassels in the color ice gray, just in case you guys are wondering. And it looks like that. So I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you love it? Do you hate it? But yeah, that's what it looks like. I personally think that it looks great the way it is and it doesn't really need another accessory, but you know, everyone each to their own. We all have our own styles. Okay, now let's talk packing cases. I did get it with my recent order and the packing cases come in a set of three. So you've got a small, medium, large. It also has a wristlet that you clip onto the side of the um, packing case onto this D-ring and then you can wear it as a wristlet. Now you can pack anything you want in these um, packing cases and it's really nice because it's got that plastic clear front so you can see what you pack in there. Now, I wanted to show you in this video which sizes fit into the Greta best. So let's just start from the largest one. I don't think the larger one is going to fit in the main compartment because 
it's quite a big pouch and I don't think it's going to fit at the back either. Let's have a look at the medium. So the medium won't fit in the slip pocket at the back. It won't fit in the pocket at the front. But I think it does fit into the main compartment, but you have to squish it in first. So I think if you've got the main compartment packed full, like with nappies or whatever, it's going to be a little tight to try and squeeze in that um that pouch because it's really snug so I think the small pouch is going to be the best size for the Greta it fits in really nicely there um, it's too tall for the front pocket and if we try and put it at the back it does fit the d-ring kind of gets caught on the side there but if you tuck it in it looks like that so I think that's really cool as well. Okay, so that's it from me. Thank you guys for tuning in today and I hope you found this video helpful and that you enjoyed watching it. So after this, they'll be on the body and a few other comparisons. So I hope you enjoy it. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.